Today, I am going to speak about a teenage girl who became a saint. She became a virgin and a martyr at the age of 12. She fought against purity. Because of purity, she paid by her life. How can she do it? What a courage she had. She has given a good example to our teenagers how we should be and how we should take care of ourselves. She is Agnes, Agnes of Rome, virgin and martyr, venerated as a saint in the Roman Catholic Church, Eastern Orthodox Church, the Anglican Communion and Lutheranism. St. Agnes of Rome is one of the several virgins martyrs commemorated by name in the Canon of the Mass. Agnes is the patron saint of girls and chastity. According to tradition, Agnes was a member of the Roman nobility, born in 291 and raised in an early Christian family. She suffered martyrdom at the age of 12 or 13 during the reign of the Roman Emperor Diocletian on 21st January 304. A beautiful young girl from a wealthy family, Agnes had many suitors of high rank and the young men slighted by her resolute devotion to religious purity, submitted by her by name to the authorities as a follower of Christianity. The prefect Sempronius condemned Agnes to be dragged naked through the streets to a bodel. In one account, as she prayed her hair, grew and covered the body. It was also said that all of the men that attempted to rape her were immediately struck blind. The son of the prefect was struck dead but revived after she prayed for him, cursing her release. Furious Sempronius tried to put her to death. She was led out and bounded to a stake. But the bundle of wood would not burn of the flame, parted away from her. The arrogant officer in charge of the troops drew his sword and beheaded her, and her blood poured to the stadium floor where other Christians soaked it up with cloths. Agnes was buried beside the Via Nomentana in Rome. A miracle attributed to her is the daughter of Constantine. First, Constantina was cured of leprosy after praying at Agnes' tomb. An early account of Agnes' death stressing her young age, steadfastness and virginity. Agnes was venerated at the time of St. Ambrose based on an existing homily. Her feast is celebrated on the 21st of January. Because of the legend around her martyrdom, she is patron saint of those seeking chastity and purity. Let's offer, let's pray for all our teenagers that they may take care of themselves, that they may not fall into temptations, that they may persevere, protecting themselves and that they may respect others. And let's teach this good example of St. Agnes to our teenagers. Especially, we may protect them from all temptations and struggles and trials. And let's be with them and help them to overcome the time of temptation or struggles or the trials that we may protect them from all dangers of the modern society. And that really they may protect their chastity and be faithful to their life. And they honor and they respect them as well as the others. St. Agnes, please protect our teenagers and all the girls.